right, check it out. Today we're looking at the ThinkPad X100e. Now this is a very cool uh, little laptop. I don't even really know what to call it. It's one of the, uh, the new sections of the industry that I really like. It's actually not a netbook, it's not a laptop, it's right in between. It doesn't use an Atom, it doesn't use a Core 2 Duo, uh, or an AMD Athlon it uses something that's right in between an ultra low voltage processor. Now both AMD and Intel have very good versions of these processors. This one uses the MV40 uh, Athlon Neo from AMD, one of the best processors out there. It is absolutely incredible. Uh, not only is it actually quite powerful and capable of doing many different tasks, but it's actually very, very good at saving energy and saving your battery. Um, with the 6L lithium ion that's in here, you actually get over four hours of battery. Uh, it's just slightly under depending on how you use it and if you keep your screen very bright. But uh, it's a very nice little book. And if you're actually kind of a little bit tired of the anemic netbooks and the atoms that you know can barely play a flash video, can't handle HD video, um, basically take a long time to open or kind of slow and sluggish. Uh, this is going to take care of that, but keep that portability. It's a slightly larger screen, so rather than having a 10 inch screen, you have a t uh, an 11.2 inch screen. And rather than having a 1024 by 600, you actually have 1366 by 768 resolution. So that means that you can actually see things on this screen. Uh, you can actually play an HD video file at 720p native and it's going to take up most of the screen. It's going to look really, really good. And that's really nice. Uh, if you use netbooks for a while, they're useful. They're good for surfing the web, checking your email, but sometimes they get really annoying because the screen is just a little bit too small, keyboard's a little bit too small, uh, the processor's just not powerful enough to play a full screen video from YouTube. This can play YouTube uh, video full screen in HD all day, every day. It can play QuickTime files at 1080p, no problem, or 720p on the screen, no problem. So very, very nice, uh, and it looks absolutely great. Take a look at this, uh, this laptop. I want to show you because it, it really is very handsome. Um, now, you'll notice it has a trackpad, which is cool because ThinkPads usually only have the little nub. This one has a trackpad, two sets of button, which is really nice. Uh, so you can either use the bottom ones for the trackpads or you can use these top ones up here. Uh, again, this is a ThinkPad, so you know it's got the quality, uh, the durability, the reliability built in that Lenovo builds in with all their ThinkPads. Um, very, very nice keyboard. Uh, it's got big wide keys. I'd venture to guess it's probably around 98% full size. It's very easy to type and it has a little, little swoop on each key so you actually know when you're at the edge uh, of the keys. Um, now let's talk a little bit about the internals. Uh, like I said, the Athlon Neo MV40, it's a 1.6 gigahertz, uh, two, gig, uh, two gigabytes of uh, DDR2 memory. Uh, it also has a 250 gigabyte hard drive, which is quite large. As far as uh, things on the outside go, uh, I'll start you off over here on this side. Uh, you have a little fan louver, two USB 2.0 ports. This is 10 100 1000 Ethernet, which is very nice. And then this is the output for your headset. Uh, on the front, there's nothing much except these two little indicator lights uh, for battery and for sleep. And then over here, you have a card reader and an additional USB 2.0 port. This yellow one means that it is powered. Also to complement uh, the 10 100 1000 Ethernet that I mentioned just a moment ago, uh, this is 802.11n. Uh, draft wireless, so it is very fast, multiple in, multiple out, uh, and that's the perfect complement for the gigabit ethernet. You have fast ethernet, you want to have fast wireless as well. Uh, that will give you uh, that ability as well, 300 uh, plus megabit per second, plus a range of over a thousand feet, so very long range. If you have an N-Draft equipped router, uh, it helps you just get better reception no matter where you are. If you're around other people, it's better to have N-Draft. It's it's a no-brainer. You definitely want N-Draft wireless on all your laptops. Uh, you also have the extended 6-cell battery, so uh, I don't even know if you saw that. It sticks out just a little bit. Um, it's not really too bad. I actually like the way it feels, and it kind of gives it a good place to hold uh, the entire thing from. Also, uh, nice little webcam right up here at the top. Uh, you know, you do have basically everything you would need on here. Uh, now, it is loaded with Windows 7 Professional, which is also another nice little upgrade. That means that if you wanted to use this uh, little netbook as a kind of business laptop, you could. If you're traveling a lot, you don't want a full-size laptop. You want something that's really small, really affordable. This is perfect for businesses because uh, it is a Lenovo. It is a ThinkPad, so it's very durable, uh, business grade, and it does have the Windows 7 Professional, which means that uh, a lot of uh, business computers can't handle Vista and Windows 7. Uh, people were iffy if whether it would work or not. They were very much set at using Windows XP, but Windows 7 Professional has XP mode. That means that any software that your company uses uh, is going to work on here regardless of you having Windows 7 on it or any other operating system. Uh, it will work in Windows XP mode, which is a very, very nice feature. And that's basically it. Uh, very nice little well-rounded laptop. Uh, you have to call that a laptop. You can't really call it a netbook, but I really like this. If you want something that's uh, kind of like a uh, a netbook on steroids, it's a little bit faster, slightly larger screen, definitely more durable, better battery life, 
can handle whatever you can throw at it because it does have that more powerful processor. Uh, this is going to be right up your alley. I really, really like it. It's the X100E uh, from Lenovo. If you have any questions on it, feel free to email me, and I will see you guys next time. For more information on the Lenovo ThinkPad X100E, type in T70-11611 into any major search engine.